Hi, I'm uh, Dr. Lauren Dwyer. I am the Academic Chair for Data Analytics and Artificial Intelligence from the School for Advanced Digital Technology at SAIT. AI or artificial intelligence is essentially, it's us trying to get computers to behave, think and act more like people. So this is everything from being able to see and identify objects, uh, to be able to predict and make decisions based on those predictions. Um, and it's everything as simple as, you know, voice assistance, as complicated as self-driving cars. AI on its own can't do much without data and without people who have actually provided those data sets and trained them and identified what is clean and what is good and what we're actually able to use. So the process of cleaning data and the process of actually getting it ready for a model to use and to use to then make predictions is so critical uh, to the success of AI. Otherwise, you can start with this huge data set, but if not all of it makes sense, you could end up with a completely incorrect answer or a very biased answer or an answer that's based on the thoughts and preferences of the person who trained it rather than a widespread group. I would say there's, there's two common misunderstandings. One, that AI and robotics are more or less the same thing. Very different. A robot would be a physical device that can move autonomously but is not necessarily going to be using AI. Um, we have robots that can do various motions, but they're human controlled. Artificial intelligence, think of that more like the brain. So we've got body in AI and we've got brain, or body in robotics and AI would be more like the brain where you're making decisions and you're more thinking. So that would be one common misconception. And the second is that AI is coming to steal all our jobs. And I bring that up as a common misconception because AI is actually a tool that we can be using, especially in education and especially with our students. And we can be providing them with the ability to use this tool, to leverage it, and to make their jobs easier. So will it shift careers? Absolutely. Will it steal them? Not so much. Um, because of the speed at which AI is growing, we have a chance especially within education and especially at SAIT, to give people that career readiness that, you know, yes, they can have various other techniques, but with AI and with this tool, it can help them stand out. So I'm most excited to see our students engage with it and, uh, and take it out into the, to the world.